hello testers in the last video we have seen uh you know distributed the steps among the different given when then right so now we will try to keep this before hook and after hook in a different file so let me create a file here let's call it as uh, base page hook base page dot spec dot ts so remove these right so control x and then paste it and then followed by after and the paste we need inputs let's try to copy this and paste it over here we'll remove unnecessary inputs later right this is done and given when then is required context is not required right let's try to keep this here only now done so obviously expected right so because the page is present in the base page this particular variable this is what is driving our automation right this is the main important object so how can we how can we import that right so here I will say export page, right? So export, export page. So we are exporting from here, right? So we are just initializing over here and then we are exporting. So now you can simply say import from where? Base page, right? Base page. What we are export, <coughs> what we are exporting from there? the page now same thing we can import over here you could see all the error messages are gone at the same time we'll try to make use of lag in spec as well let's try to distribute even more so user is on the login page these everything control x keep it in the login page so obviously we need to do imports we'll just copy paste from here copy and then paste it along with it you can also take the Login successful. It's not needed over here. Let's try to keep it over here itself. And upon logout, that should be fine, right? So now you can see we have a base page where we have before and after hook. You can have before step and before after step, before all, after all. We will see in the future. And we are initializing over here. And then we are exporting. And same thing we are making use of here, right? So I think we are good we can run it and yesterday we just is visible but we did not assert it so let's say constant is visible is visible equal to right so we can say expert is visible to equal to true should be good right so now let us try running it and there should not be any failures right so our login page login feature is still blank home page or else we can do one thing control x and then paste it in the login feature let's try to add future future to test login functionality one or else we'll just copy and this is going to be one and this is going to be two. Generally, we don't numbering like that. But timing, let's keep as this. I think we're all good. And it's time to run the script. NPM test. So this is the first one. So no change in the functionality, no impact. It is failing for some reason. Let's see what is the reason. Okay, it is failing over here. Okay, it is saying expect received. 
equal to true. Let's try to debug it quickly. npm test. Let's see what is the value coming under is visible. Login. So it is false. What is wrong with it? Edit your account information is visible. Okay, just a such an issue. We can handle it later. The timing, no, let it fail as this and we'll handle in the future. Let's continue. It's not needed. As long as the execution is going on, we are good. We'll see what is the issue with this. Okay, apart from this particular uh, exception, we are all good. Right? There is no impact in the functionality. What we have done in this particular session, simply we just removed whatever we have written inside of a spec page to a common spec page. We can say base page dot specs ts. So here we have added before and all, before and after. And definitely we have to export this page because this is a page where every spec page will be using it. There are two ways. You can also, it is not needed that, okay, I don't want to give the access page directly. You can simply say export, export function, function name, get page. No parameter is of type page, right? Simply say return page. This is also fine, right? So now here it will be get page. So you cannot use page directly. So it is going to be page indirect way. We are not giving the access of page to the directly. So that is the reason we have given get page. Otherwise fine, but this sounds a little uh, good comparing with the earlier one page directly so get page get page get page and then get page you will get all your suggestions and all you can see get page dot locator click and everything you will get it no need to worry about because it's a typescript you have type defined over here and then you will get your data intelligence anywhere we are good all we have done is simply remove the code we have written in a single file and we have distributed among different spec files Especially the base page is important because this is where the initialization takes place. Not only the page, you can also export your context if somebody need. And anyway, browser also. Are not needed, browser depends upon the framework. But yeah, okay. So that's all for this particular video. Thanks for watching.